But Dennis Everberg has the puck in the back of his own. Around for Mark Andre Cleish. Cleish to Everberg. The clouds in front. Pass went off a Canuck skate. Winds up at the right point. Redmond with a long shot. Deflected to the corner. Derek Dorsett went over a thousand penalty minutes himself this year. He's at a thousand and twelve. John Mitchell pokes the puck into the back of his own. Banks it to the left point. Here's a long shot by Nick Holden, blocked by Eddie Lack, and he hangs on for the whistle. The puck to the side to Stewart. John Mitchell carries it. Right side feed to Shane, throws one on goal, stick saved by Lack. Henrik Sedin collects the rebound. Here's a chance for Stewart from the line, and Lack might have got a piece of that. The Gimlet. Back to Brad Stewart. Long slap shot, blocker saved, rebound loose. Lack out of his net and have had his stick lifted by O'Reilly and Landeskog's on with a puck. Caught up in skates. O'Reilly comes in to try to free the puck and now Landeskog from the corner. Fires back, left point. Hita with a blast. Glove saved by Lack. Abs go to work on the five on three. Great chance to open the score. Barry down the right. Here's O'Reilly. Barry at the point. O'Reilly again. Again, the shoots. Lack the save and he hangs on. Passes down, O'Reilly to Tyson Berry. McGinley wants the pass for the one timer. Right comes to O'Reilly, looking across, puts one to the crease. Black squeezed the pass, it's in, but the whistle blew. No goal. Here's a shot by Tange, blocked by Benino. Tange centers again, that deflected, winds up on the Canuck stick, and it's shot down the ice by Benino. Puck back into the Canuck zone. Hendrick Sedin trying to dig it out of skates. Tan Evan Edler, both below the goal line as well. Now McLeod comes up with the puck, puts it to the crease, and to Verbata, but he took a look and missed the pass. The other number 17, Brad Stewart, trying to move the puck out, but the Canucks get it back to Adler. In front, Daniel, stopped by Barra, who stayed with him on the deep to the forehand. Henrik Sedin, Edler sneaking in. Pass comes to Daniel. He's looking back to Weber, I think, but instead he feeds Henrik on the right side. Henrik, in the face-off circle. Daniel, Verbata, hit the post! Edler on the rebound, doesn't shoot it. He is out of the box. He backhands it up the boards, and Hishin sends it outside the line, actually to the line. It was held in by Weber, but now brought out by Redmond. Up the left wing, Caron with a long shot, heading wide, but Lack stuck the right pad on it. Now Caron again, plays it up the boards, held in by Landeskog. He comes out of the pile with the puck, looks in front, tried a shot, a weak one. Now it's loose in front, a backhander stopped by Lack as he tracked that one and was able to stop Alex Tongue. Couldn't corral it on the feed in front. Now he's got it at the left point. 15 seconds to go on the man advantage. Again, left on the left side, in front. Spinning was O'Reilly, here's Landeskog. And the puck rolled off his stick right into the pads of Lack, who was able to cover up. Puck dumped into the Vancouver zone, hand use. Delays before sending one forward. Henrik Sedin carries in. Here's Burroughs with a quick shot. And swallowed up by Barra. O'Reilly wins this one from Vey. Barry with a dangerous move. Matthias intercepts the puck. Here's Weber testing Barra. Had a little trouble with it, but he knocked it down and fell on the puck for another stoppage. Barry to Aginlu who tried a shot, and that fluttered over top of the goal. Landeskog onto the puck again. Good pressure from the Avalanche. Landeskog cuts in front. Now he shoots. They score! Aginla might have touched it in front. And the Avs open the scoring. 22nd time in 30 games the Canucks have surrendered the opening goal. Well, I don't think this is the matchup that Willie Desjardins really wanted. The Horvat line out against the Landeskog line. And Jerome Aginla gets planted in front of the net. Landeskog goes all the way around. And this shot from Landeskog hits Jerome Aginla in front. Off his side and beats Eddie Lack. Eddie didn't see it at all. And it's deflected by Aginla, who's right at the top of the crease. And it's just inside the post. Goal number 26. Many teams have been at late. I never believed that ad. It's about 2 nothing being the most dangerous lead in hockey, but maybe it is. Abs will try to do it right here. O'Reilly in front through the legs of Hamus. Here's Redmond with a shot, and Lack stopped that. The puck came off Hamus and wide of the goal. Big in from Landeskog and Tyson Berry. The scoring play and the only goal of the game so far. 1 0 Avalanche. We're five minutes into the second. Here's Aginla moving back in. In front for Duchesne. Wrist shot blocker saved by Lack. And he's moves to check in. This defense pair has been out a little while. Forwards were able to change. Centering pass. Here's Hamilton. And a blocker saved by Lack on that. Freddie Hamilton off. 
Puck winds up in the stick of Verbat, who throws it in front. O'Reilly on the backhand clears it out to center ice. Poked past Edler. Landeskog turns. O'Reilly to the mid. Lack held it out, and it's cleared off the glass to the blue line. Controls the puck. He's stripped of it. Landeskog in on goal. He deeks. Stopped by Lack after the turnover on the breakaway. Trying to make it 2 nothing. Here's Redmond at the blue line with a long shot. That's why Tangay scores. Alex Tangay on the ricochet. It was only a matter of time as the Avalanche get another one behind Lack, and it's 2 nothing. Uh, Chris Higgins, when you're the last man, you can't do this. You have to make a play, and Higgins' last man, Landis Gog, got the breakaway. Eddie Lack, great save, but then it's still scramble time. Look at O'Reilly looking around. The Canucks still chasing, 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 and there's Alex Tangay all by himself. Quiet feed, and Landis Gog centers. Here's a gimlet the side as the puck ricocheted off Tangay. Neither could get a shot through. But the Avalanche men came to control the puck. Centering feed, O'Reilly to the crease. Lack's got the puck as the Avalanche never really got a clean shot on goal. Flips the puck to the corner. O'Reilly shovels it along to Aginla. 40 seconds left in the power play. Puck hasn't left the zone. Here's O'Reilly centering Tange across. They score. No, they didn't. Or did they? Yeah, they did, sorry. <laughs> he couldn't have missed oh, from there. Man. What a passing play. And Landeskog makes it 3-0. You talked about the puck movement. Colorado Avalanche, how can this power play be 29th in the league the way they can throw it around and throw it around here. Separation through the zone, through the seam, and right off the middle of the net. Look at this pass. Right underneath Henrik Sedin's stick. He's in the passing lane, but uh, it gets through him. Puck shoveled ahead to Mitchell. Hard pass, knocked away on the exit. Canucks try to break back. Benino in on the right wing. Nick Benino. Carries to the corner. Sharp angle shot. Stop. Here's Verbata from the other side. Another sharp angle bid that Barra came across to hold up. To the the shots, yes, he did. Okay. But the shots being 30 to 15. That's I'm emphasizing both 30, and we haven't finished the second period yet. Spirited effort from the Avalanche, and they're two on one. Cleese with Everberg. Cleese in. Shoots. Kicked out by the left pad of Eddie Lack the face off and Stewart rips the puck all the way down the ice. Canucks 0 for 1 on the power play. And here's Weber in scores. Just what the doctor ordered. 15 seconds into the third the Canucks are on the board. Boy oh boy how did Yannick Weber get so wide open. The Avalanche win the faceoff, shoot it in, and then there's nobody within 10 feet of Yannick Weber. And he just blows it by Vera. Look at Weber head up, he's got some room, and he makes no mistake about that one. Daniel Sedin towards the goal, deflected just wide. Hendrick Sedin behind the net for Burroughs. Alex Burroughs on the forehand, pass to Daniel Sedin, behind the net to Henrik Sedin. Daniel going to the front, Henrik looking across, Spiza stopped by Barra. Daniel, Weber recovers, stops to get away from the check. Ahead to Dorsey, didn't play it forward. Instead stopped the puck along the boards, now he gives it away to McLeod, whose long shot is stopped by Andy Lack. He backhands it into the avalanche zone and moves in on Hayda. Gives him a jolt as the puck is played around. Kennens now knocks down Landeskog. Puck played the line, held in by Verbata. Here's Benino. Mitchell got there first. Four and a half gone in the third. Puck comes in front. Lack sweeps it to the side. Burroughs can't catch up. Hold it to the corner to Aginla. Tees it up for Mitchell off the left shoulder of Eddie Lack. Bay comes up with a puck. Working off the left wing. Fan on his pass. Keeps control. Backhands into the corner for Matthias. Puts the puck on the forehand, passes to Hanhuis, wrist shot, stopped by Barra, rebound, stopped again, and this time Barra hangs on for the whistle. Higgins and Edler from the corner, the defenseman's in deep, stumbled a bit, but he's got the puck, fires back, Weber to Horvath, covering for Edler, here's Higgins to the net, into the glove of Barra, with Hansen providing a disturbance in front. He's the puck in behind the goal, Barra out of his net, gets it by Burroughs and up the boards, Henrik holds the line, his pass picked off. Aginla up to Deshane, 
Two on one with Mitchell. Deshane shoots. Walker saved by Lack. We look cool making that one. Time coming off. Benino moves up the gap. Finds some room in the backhand. And then in the last second, he was checked. But the Avs can't clear. Tanev, hard pass to Hamhuse. Slap shot. Stopped by Barra. Loose puck. And Benino gets it to the goal line. Burrows back to Hamhuse. Fans want it towards the net. Benino. He'll switch places with Hamhuse. Move into the face-off circle. Shoot. Rebound. Loose at the side. Benino gets it. Just over a minute to go. And Hamhuse brings the puck up. Stripped of it from behind. And Mitchell has the open goal. No mistake for him. John Mitchell into the empty net. And with exactly a minute to go, Colorado salts it away. They're up 4-1. to one. Well, Dan Hamhuse trying to lead the rush. Goalie out. Didn't head man it quick enough, and there's Duchesne, good move, steals it. And Mitchell, no mistake from inside the 